Hey everyone, Captain John here. So today we'll be taking the uh, Stan State basketball team, the Warriors, down to Torrance, California to play uh, Dominguez Hills basketball team. Um, so yeah, it's gonna be about a three day trip. Uh, I'm gonna head on down over the grapevine, stop for lunch, and then head on to the hotel before I take him to the university to practice. So here we go. And we just stopped here in Lebec, California, right near Wheeler Ridge. It's a little uh, rest up. We always stop at when we're going from north to south, or sometimes south to north. Right there is the grapevine, that large mountain right there. You go right between those peaks. Anyways, uh, everyone's grabbing their lunch, taking about a 30 minute break, use the restroom, that kind of stuff. And then, uh, yeah, we're gonna hit that hill. We got some traffic heading into LA. It's gonna take us about another three hours to get to Torrance. Uh, and I gotta take them over to the uh, college later tonight so they can practice a little before we call it a night. And we just made it here to Torrance, California, right down the street from uh, Crenshaw Boulevard. And we parked back here. Thankfully, we found a spot that's literally the only spot left on property. So I'm glad there was a spot. All these other spots, as you can see, are kind of uh, a car every other stall, so we can't fit a bus in there.
So yeah, um, actually, um, what I didn't show here is I dropped off, uh, we, we got here and then we uh, dropped off some of the team. Uh, a few of the other team uh, members, they wanted to go out for dinner. So I took them to the mall around the corner. We hang out there for about an hour so they can eat and rest and kind of walk around. Came back to the hotel and then we're gonna call it a night tomorrow morning. Um, I don't think they do breakfast here at this hotel. So I'm gonna take them for breakfast in the morning. Uh, so kind of stay tuned for that. And I think this is where we get into to, to our room. Give me one minute. And we're in, okay, so, so my stuff's already in the room. So let's go take a look at the room, see what a, a Marriott here in Torrance, California looks like. If you're not sure where Torrance is, we're about, I'd say about 20 minutes south of LA. Tour of the restroom. It's an outdoor sink or out of bathroom sink, I should say. There's the bathroom. Two queen beds. I got all my effects there on the bed. And I got some Arby's from where we stopped at the grapevine. And I also got um, a Subway sandwich for tomorrow because tomorrow, after breakfast, I probably won't eat breakfast. Um, after breakfast, I'll bring him back to the hotel, hang out here uh, for the morning, and then around 1 p.m. So we got a, quite a stretch, kind of hang out for the day. Uh, by 1 p.m., I take um, over to the college where they're going to play tomorrow, and they're going to do what's called a shoot around. They practice shooting the ball, getting warmed up, that kind of stuff. Uh, game is not till six, so I'm assuming after that practice, we're going to come back to the hotel again, uh, so they can kind of rest, get ready, get mentally prepared for their game. And then, yeah, head back to the college, um, Dominguez Hills College. We're doing a 6 p.m. game, I believe, uh, so which means we probably won't be back to the hotel until 10, 30, maybe 11 o'clock tomorrow night. And then uh, the very next morning around 9, we'll head back up to Stan State, where I picked them up in Turlock, California. And I will head home for the weekend. Uh, that'll be Friday morning, so, yeah, and I'm off for the weekend, so that'll be nice. So, yeah, stay tuned. Uh, we're going to get some rest right now, and tomorrow morning we'll be at it again. And good morning, everybody. Just got the bus pre-tripped. About to head down the street to Denny's to eat breakfast. This particular hotel does not have a, uh, a breakfast. So we're gonna take the team down so they have something to eat. And as I promised, here we are at Denny's. Gonna grab some uh, some eggs and bacon, maybe some hash browns. Good way to start the day. All right, that was some good food I just showed you. Nice full belly. Wait for the team to finish, take them back to the hotel, kind of hang out there for a while. Check out this uh, Mercedes, just like the car I just bought. It's a nice car. Anyways, take them back to the hotel. We will uh, take them later this afternoon uh, to practice at the college, come back to the hotel again, then go back to the college to play the game tonight, then back to the hotel and sleep. Who's this rolling up on my in my bus? Oh, wait, my bus is right there. Who's this? That is John Harnden, the original Captain John. He's actually here uh, with the women's basketball team. We have the men's, same school. Uh, they're about to finish their game, so he's picking them up. And uh, yeah, we're gonna. He's gonna head back home tonight. I will wait till tomorrow. Let's see what he says real quick. Hey, John. 
Okay, so yeah, um, so yeah, he's gonna drive down to another parking lot right down the way there, and uh, I'm gonna follow him. So what I'm gonna do, since it's a bit of a walk, I'm gonna ride with John back up the hill. Uh, it's about a quarter mile back to the uh, to the gym where they're playing. So I'm going to leave my bus here, ride with John back up the hill. Uh, that way I can watch the men's basketball play. Um, and then uh, I'll just have to walk back to the bus and grab it right when they're uh, finished playing. So that's what we're gonna do. So I gotta watch my team play. Gotta show my support. That's why you're the original Captain John. <laughs> 51 years, kiddo. The OG. You've been driving 51 years? 51 years. My goodness. Started in November of 2000. 2000. <laughs> <laughs> A whole nother century. I'm sorry, that long. <laughs> 1972, baby. Wow, 1972. My goodness. I wasn't even born yet. 3 million miles later. Three million? Well, wow. you think it'd be more than that. I mean, I, I know you don't drive as much as a trucker, but you can read out from Greyhound. Six years of Greyhound. Yeah. Across the country. You probably did more than three million. It's gotta be up there somewhere. Because most truck drivers will do a million in four years, but they drive a lot more than us. Yeah. So you're fifty years. Oh so yeah, you gotta be more than three million. Well, what a good way to end the video. They won by one point. It was such a great game. They all hustled very, very well. Great players. Now, one thing I do notice with uh, high school and college sports teams, we deal with a lot. And we also deal with a lot of professionals. You know, we do uh, uh, professional baseball. We do the NFL. We do um, NBA, although I've never done the NBA teams. Um, I have to say, 
college and high school. These guys um, are very respectful and um, uh, very engaging with uh, with everybody. Not to say the NFL and NBA are not, or the uh, professional baseball, but we see it more with this um, this level, uh, college and, and the high school levels. Uh, just a lot of um, professionalism, a lot of good sportsmanship with within all the other players, uh, other teams. Um, and it, it just you know makes me feel good to see that, and I hope that continues. If any of you guys are watching this, uh, stay humble and, and stay stay uh, on that course. You guys are doing an amazing job. And gradually, congratulations for winning. Um, I won't be with you guys in the next game, but hopefully I'll be with you uh, on one in the near future. And uh, who knows, maybe we'll uh, see some championships or something here in, in the near future. That'd be awesome. Hopefully I'm a part of that. And for everyone else, we will see you down the road. And real quick before I actually sign off the video, we did stop here at a Raising Cane's Chicken. Haven't had these in quite some time. Get a little grub on before we hit the road, go home.